there, Leo. Thanks so much for tuning in. This is Astro Girl, and here is your forecast for the week March 24 through 30th. And the good news first, there's a new moon in Aries on Sunday, and of course that's your fellow fire sign, your ninth house of long distance travel, spirituality and higher education, all areas you're going to be thinking of with the Sun and Uranus, the planet of unpredictable events and unusual events, all in the same part of your chart. If Ages ago, you put in for an overseas transfer or talk to your boss about possibly being transferred overseas. Don't be too shocked when they walk into your office and say, hey, do you still want to you know, transfer overseas? Meanwhile, you've bought a house or you've met someone or you've had a baby or you've got a dog and you are totally shocked and blown away. Be careful what you wish for. Keeping in mind, Leo's, that Jupiter, the planet of good luck, opportunity, and, you know, can't say no, moves into your sign July 17. So it's not far off, April, May, June, July, four months for you to really get rid of everything that's not going to be of any further use to you and be able to move into the future with no baggage. Because once Jupiter moves into your sign, it's only there for a year and it happens very quickly. The thing about this new moon on Sunday is that Jupiter and the moon and Uranus and Pluto sort of get in the way of the new moon. So if you want to make a new beginning under this year's Aries new moon, which is a very important one, your task, Leos, will be to, will be to find a way to preserve the good in the past before you can really transition into your future. So keep that in mind. You don't have to cut everyone off and everything out. Keep the good bits, but release the bits that aren't working for you back into the universe where they belong. Venus, the goddess of love, remains in your relationship zone. And that is making it very easy for you to make new friends and also meet interesting people that you maybe wouldn't normally meet simply through hanging out with friends and they bring their friends along and within this group for single Leos there's a very good possibility of meeting someone worth meeting. An Aquarius, Aries, all good matches. Librans, all good matches for you. Have a great week and I'll speak to you again next week.